Hey YouTubers, I uh, just wanted to give you an update on uh, my GoPro setup. It's changed quite a bit since it did uh, a few years ago when I initially had it set up. That's what it looked like initially, a long time ago. I'm not sure if you can see that all that clearly, but uh, I've changed hardware. Um, in the case, I've uh, added some things that I use and I've removed some things that I don't use. And uh, in a period of time, I kind of had a sticker obsession, as you can see. So, a lot of you will recognize these. So, let's just go uh, over my uh, setup. <clears throat> this is a Pelican 1400 case. I've had this for quite a few years and it's served me very well. Now, uh, inside here I did change the layout because I got some new hardware and I noticed some things I don't actually use anymore um, and don't need, so I removed them from the case. Um, I'll just go over what everything is. and uh, Over here I've got the uh, suction cup mount. <clears throat> Rarely use it, so I made a smaller compartment for it. I think of as much space. Um, SD card, the little uh, blackout stickers if I ever need them, haven't had to use them yet. The blackout housing. Um, I put these in here like this. These are the shorter ones down here and then I have two larger ones here because I would always have a hard time finding it digging through this accessory area right here. Um, over here I changed the way the batteries are. I put two batteries here and a power bank which is uh, 7800 milliamp hours um, 2.1 amps and 5 point sorry 2.1 amps and 1.2 amps output um, so it does a good job of charging the GoPro and other accessories on the go if necessary um, also, I have only one 10 watt power charger because two was really unnecessary. Um, I've got the display with extra memory card in here and the battery with an extra memory card and a memory card reader. Not in here, in the other one. So, two memory cards in here and I see I removed the memory card the adapter for the standard SD size um, but I do have this tiny little USB reader that works just fine so the 10 watt adapter um, under here I purchased this it is a battery charger for the GoPro separate standalone charger um, and it actually works 100 volts, 240 volts, so this will work in Europe. I have a little adapter in my Jambox case um, that I just plug it in and I can use it in Europe as well. So I got this, it works very nicely. DigiPower bought it from Amazon, pretty good price too. So that's that over there. Here is the little back wind door for the blackout housing. Um, I don't often use this but I put it here just in case and here is my blackout housing with the GoPro inside waterproof case too um, here I've got two of the older cases um, this one is for sound I'm going to be drilling more, more holes here uh, so that I can get better sound it's to use it instead of the frame because I didn't want to spend the extra money I already had this one just a little uh, cloth to wipe the screen of the GoPro or these cases and also separate these two so I don't scratch them. Now this one is my waterproof dive case that I've used it to 50 meters below the water and it worked extremely well, no problems with it. And it's got the added battery compartment in here as well. So again this is the blackout housing, the uh, frame type housing.
Um, my head, uh, sorry, my mount for the head. Just put this on your head. I actually was able to fit this over a helmet when I uh, went on a scooter in Cuba, and it was uh, a very sturdy, very nice grip on it as well. So it didn't slide off the helmet at all, um, or didn't shake around. So I just keep this here, and I keep this on it as well, uh, because I've been doing some shooting out and about, and I want to have this always ready. Tripod mount. Um, I use a tripod that is, uh, goodness, what is the model? It's the KQ-666 model. Um, just got it. Really like it. I'm very happy with it. So The remote with a wristband. Remote for if you want to put it on, sorry, remote stand if you want to put it on a clip or whatever. I've got the mountain bike or biking uh, clip. In here I've got a bunch of a uh, bunch of these type of accessories. And in the bottom here you'll see I've got the uh, well, keychain accessory, the little vibration accessory, different mount, a bunch of different little connectors that connect on different angles, different directions. Um, in here I actually keep my touch screen housing. This is very sensitive so I don't want to scratch it or get it poked by these other things so I put it here separately um, and it helps it to last longer without getting destroyed. So I forgot to put that in front of there to stop the stuff from going in. But yeah, that's about it over here. Um, they fit very nicely. I don't have to worry about damaging anything. And I've got the tripod mount, uh, sorry, little gorilla, gorilla pod. Now, uh, in the top portion of it, I put things that I very rarely use. Um, an extended USB cable that I can run it for extended time lapses. Um, my little remote charger and a little USB cable to plug to the power adapter and to the GoPro directly. Um, I rarely, very rarely use these so I just hid them in here. Put them nice and flat and then just put this uh, rubber mat on here and it works just fine for me so and it sits in there just fine but yeah this uh, the only thing that really takes a while to wrap up is this because it's quite a bit of <coughs> material to keep together no, and they all fit fine for me I'm very happy with it uh, the before I was keeping this just on top um, because I got this extra um, and I actually find I use this very regularly the buttons are far easier to press than the older housing um, but I didn't want to keep it on top anymore because it was getting uh, you know, too close to the top and I didn't want to damage it um, but yeah this is just suction cup mount with the cord that you wrap around your uh, signal mirror so that in case it does fly off or your windshield wipers in case it does fly off this thing will keep it there as an emergency backup so yeah let me know what you think of the changes uh, to my case um, and uh, give me any comments like subscribe and uh, thanks for watching